Hey guys, Pretzelman945 here. Welcome back to another video. Uh, today I'm once again joined by my dad. I'm back! <laughs> um, and today what I thought would be a funny idea, since uh, me recording One Piece characters tier list is like one of my most popular videos, I thought it would be funny if my dad ranked One Piece characters even though he knows absolutely nothing about One Piece. Um... So, um, I have the tiers based on what I thought he would say. We have looks kind of awesome, seems really cool, looks cool, seems boring, and what the heck is that? Um, and so I found this pretty short list of characters that encompasses a good spread of major and minor characters across the series. Um, so I, I'm, I'm going to tell the name of each character um, this is mostly just going to be based off looks. If my, if, if my dad wants to know, I will give a few details about each character, but, um, and then I'll also, if he wants to see a bigger image, I'll be, pu I'll be putting up, um, I'll, I'll find a Google image that provides, like, a better picture. Uh, so this first one is Ace. Ace. Uh, yeah, I need to see, uh, okay. might as well, might as well just, uh. Yeah, I'll, I'll have this, uh, just, like, an extra tab open. Okay. Okay. Well, okay. The, this is this is a good, like, full-body image, I guess. Okay, alright. And all this right. is a better, like, facial close-up. Alright, so, looks like he's, uh, you know, he's got that, he's got that, that, like, uh, I, I'm going to smack you down kind of look, like kind of vibe going on that's like pre that's pretty accurate that's you know pretty i mean accurate. obviously they 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 drew him with some some you know some muscularity there so mm -hmm. you know he, he's he's definitely looking like um you know uh I, i'm i'm you know i i know i'm going to uh, um kick some some rear here uh yeah yeah so i would say that is uh, we'll put him on the second one there. That's uh, seems really cool. Yeah. Okay. 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 All right. All right. So the next one we have is uh, Kainu. All right. This one's a big guy. Okay. Oh, okay. He, yeah. He's he's a marine admiral. Marine admiral. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. Uh. I mean, you know, does he wear that coat thing a lot? Is that... Uh, yeah, yeah. So, okay. So, so basically, right, we got... so, so these kinds of coats are basically like, if you're if you're powerful or you have any sense of status, whether you're a pirate or a marine in one piece, you wear one of these coats because it makes you look cool, <laughs> basically. It, it, yeah, I mean... All, he, all the admirals and a bunch of the major marines wear it, so... Um, he's yeah. rocking the coat. Yeah. Um... Well, what was on his hat? What does that say? Marine. Like, it, yeah, it says Marine on Like, the hat. So if you didn't know, he's kind of broadcasting <laughs> uh -huh. to you. And yeah. Of course, he's got the classic, uh, you know, cigar in the mouth bit. Yeah. You know, I mean, that's... Uh, you don't mess with a guy if he's got... Uh -huh. if he's chomping on yeah, the cigar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? That's, um, that's kind of like... Um, so something, something I will mention about him is like... Um, with One Piece, the way the power system works is they have these things called devil fruits, which are these fruits that provide, like, unique powers. He has magma powers. I, I mean, I, you know, it doesn't really matter. He's got a cigar. Right? <laughs> I mean, okay. that, that's, so, that's so, top so, tier. So, right top, top tier. Top okay. He's got the All cigar. right. He's like, I mean, okay. I got the coat. I got the cigar. <laughs> don't don't come near here. Just, like, okay. just don't even. Like, okay. right? Uh, this next one, I think, will be, uh, quite interesting. So, there's two versions of this character. This is before she eats the devil fruit, and this is after she eats the devil fruit. So, basically, the devil fruit is a weight loss drug. <laughs> yes, right? like it, what, it basically um, Zimpec or whatever. The, <laughs> uh, she totally, she totally rocked. Yeah, it. it kind of like makes her body smoother. Is is the idea behind it? I yeah. mean, so but does she carry the the club all the time? Uh yes, that's her weapon. Okay, I mean, so 
where 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 we we ate the rate the weight loss uh you know whatever fruit fruit what De- devil fruit devil fruit i'm yeah. gonna say dragon fruit to devil fruit okay i'll try to remember that okay yeah but i mean she's rocking the club i mean we got like a purple <laughs> cape we got you know like kind of like birkenstock thing going on there <laughs> uh for the sandals I, yeah. i'm gonna put her in the uh in that second tier there oh, oh seems really cool seems okay really cool. i mean come on she, right, she, she, okay. went, she, she she went down on the on the on the on the Devil fruit, you know. Okay. All right. So this is Aokiji. So this guy is a Marine at one point in the series, and then he uh, leaves the Marines for reasons in the story. Well, wait. When he leaves the Marines, does the coat go away? The jacket? Uh, he wears this. This is what oh, he looks see, like without see, the Marines. That, okay. And, and, got and this, there. this is his Marine fit, and he has ice powers. I, I, no, the, the the point is, is like he downgrades <laughs> majorly. Like going, I'm sorry that 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 that's uh, that's uh, what's the seems boring. Um, yeah, yeah, we okay, can't, we can't, okay. we got we penalty for losing the the cool marine coat. That, okay, that's, that's that's an issue. I actually don't remember which character this is, so we're just gonna skip it. All right, um. Now this next one, I'm I'm very curious to see your opinion on. This is Arlong. So and he's... and and the idea behind this is he's a separate race from humans that are called a fishman. Okay, he looks like a goblin to me, not a fish. <laughs> okay, that that's like like to me that's like a traditional goblin look. Like if you think, if I think about like the goblin in in Spider Man, like they they could they're, be cousins. They're, they're, they're kind of meant now, to they're kind of, they're kind of meant to resemble different kinds of fish, the different kinds of fishmen. So he's like one of I, I think he might be uh, drawn to represent like a like a. Uh, a sawfish, or something like that. I think I'm. I'm not. Okay, that's I'm not weird. Exactly sure. I mean, I get like he. Yeah, the no, the nose is like weird. Okay. Yeah. So you you go. Uh, 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 what uh, the uh, heck uh, is that? No, that's not that no, extreme. No. I think that's in the the seems more. I'm sorry. It's <laughs> okay. Fishman, right, come on. Right, uh, right. I mean, we're we're going okay. downhill here. That's not that, that's not happening. Okay. <laughs> we have a marine clown. Oh, he's not a marine. Um, he's wearing the coat. Not, not, not everyone that wears this coat is a marine. Oh well, but he's, he gets. He, I mean, that's the cool coat. You know, uh, th- this is another <laughs> image of him. Um, uh, a little bit later on in this series. All right, so he's like, he's like, he's like freaky clown dude. It, th- that's that's basically the idea behind his design. Okay. All right. I mean, yeah, I there's, guess there's, there's a couple different pictures that you can look at for this because he has different looks. This is the most recent look that he has from where I'm caught up to. Um, buggy, huh? Well, all right, uh, buggy. We're gonna put buggy at the middle there. Looks cool. Yeah. Okay. You know, not awesome, but you know. All right. Crazy clown dude. All right. Now, this next character is one of my absolute favorite characters. This is Whitebeard. Oh, oh, okay. I... Time, t- time out here. <laughs> the, the dude's name's Whitebeard. <laughs> I know he doesn't have a white beard. I know it. I know. And he is beardless. <laughs> yeah. That's kind of like ZZ Top had, like, the two dudes in the front had the massive beards, but the drummer's name... <laughs> Was Frank Beard, and he was he had no beard. Um, like that's now, that's now, the weird. That, that, I, mean, I I will say they kind of um, look like elephant tusks. He, uh, that's his mustache. I, I'm saying he's got like, uh, <laughs> but he is wearing. He does he, have the coat though, and, and and he's and he's very big and muscular. I, I think like canonically he's something like 28 I, feet tall or something. 
uh, in, in the One Piece world or yeah, something. I'm sorry. What the heck is that? <laughs> no, oh, no. Oh, no. You can't name oh. him Whitebeard and give him no beard <laughs> and have his mustache look like Elephant Tusks. Okay. Now, it um, doesn't work. A name that you might actually be more familiar with is there is actually a character named Blackbeard. In oh, but he series. has a beard, doesn't he? Uh, well, yeah. yeah, yeah. This is like the new. This is like some older pictures. Like his beard grows out more as the series goes on. But this he is his has more a beard. recent okay. series where his where his beard is like fully in action right there. The thing is, is like you know, for Blackbeard, like that's a legendary name, right? You know, yeah. Like, I mean, that's like the pirate of pirates. Yeah, uh, he's. Kinda there, but not quite. All I'm, I'm putting Looks him in the cool. middle. Yeah. Looks cool. Okay. Okay. I, I know who the next one is. That's good because I don't. <laughs> I have to look at the picture. To, uh... Okay. This is Ben Beckman. Okay. He has a large gun. I think. Is that? I hope that's what that is. Yes. Oh, okay, that's a rifle there. Okay. Alright. Uh I don't know, I'm I'm kinda mad on this one. That's uh boring? Yeah. Okay. Alright, alright. Uh let's see. Bellamy. Okay. Uh now we do have a couple different pictures. This is an older one. And then this is like a, a, a one from a later arc in the series. I mean the 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 he I mean the the older one like he's got the eyes like 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 freaky looking like man okay yeah like he's like a little psycho or something. He has um like he has a so he has a blue version of the coat. Yeah, and he has a devil fruit that allows him to basically, like, make his feet become, like, springs, basically. And he can, like, spring around the place. And, like... Okay, that's do, weird. Like, crazy jumps and stuff like that. That's kind of weird, but... Okay. You know, uh... I, I, he looks cool. All right. Okay. It's fine. Okay. Uh, now, similar name, but not quite the same. This is... Bellamere. Well, yeah. I mean, with that many characters, they probably like run into a like, <laughs> you know, running out of names issue. Okay, so but but so her name is Bellamere, but she's walking around with a shirt that has mace on it. So that's a little weird. You know, <laughs> okay. it's like like a little confusion, like. I don't really like, like. She's got an identity crisis going on here. Like, identity crisis. She's she's a little okay, confused. Okay. Now I will say, <laughs> she's a former marine, so she doesn't wear the coat. But like, this is some fan art where it happens. Well, all right, and it, but... and it, and it happens in like a flashback scene. Right, and what when what, she's still what... a marine? So I don't know if you want to take that into account. So, but what weapon does she have? Um. She she just uses guns, but like she 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 okay. she basically she rescues two little girls and she quits the Marines to raise them. So she doesn't okay, she, so... she doesn't really fight necessarily. Um. So she's like just like cut. really all over the place. So she's like a mom, a former Marine mom, basically. Oh well, you know, I mean. You know, props for that, right? So yeah, uh, I'll put her in the second from the top. Seems really cool. Yeah. Okay. I mean, we gotta we gotta lose points for having like identity crisis, but beyond <laughs> okay. that, we're, we're cool. Okay. This uh, is Beppo. Uh, oh man, and, and he's doing he's doing the the Karate Kid thing, the whatever pose that was from Karate Kid. <laughs> I don't think he is. Yeah, yes. Look, look at that first. That, that's definitely the Karate Kid thing. <laughs> Except he's like a little cute bear with like with like sharp teeth. Uh huh. You know, it's like 
you know... Explaining, like, what he is... Look at all those sharp <laughs> teeth. <laughs> explaining what Beppo is in the One Piece War would be way too complicated. That's not important here. Yeah. We got... We got we're, 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 we're a, a bear that does... Uh, the Karate Kid thing, and we have sharp teeth, and yeah, he's uh, he's top, he's top tier. Okay, wow. <laughs> All right, okay. Wait, there's a character, Big Mom. <laughs> yes, top tier name only. <laughs> I don't care, <laughs> Big Mom. You sure you don't want to look at examine the pictures? First? It doesn't matter. It's Big she, Mom. She does have a cape. And and stuff. Uh, top tier, Big Mom. Okay, immediately, like no hesitation there. All right, okay. Bon Clay. Yes. Does he go wee oui, wee, oui, Monsieur? Uh, no. Oh. That would have been. Cool. He's kind of looking French though with that outfit. <laughs> I mean, that looks a little... I'm sorry, what the heck is that? He's got swans and a weird French outfit, and he's got a Frenchy name. Okay, okay. okay. Next. All right. Um, Okay, so this next one is my personal favorite of the Marine Admirals. Admiral. And, and, And this is Kizaru, and he has... Light powers. All right, but so he's, like he's he kind of looking like light and he moves at the speed so, of so light. So he's got okay. So or he's like got his power. He's got the pinstripe suit. So plus the coat. Yeah, yeah, and the glasses. Yeah, I mean he's and he's looking like I am, like, you know, I, I'm it. Like he. Uh-huh. He's top tier. I mean, top tier. Yes. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Finally, one of my favorite characters. <laughs> okay. All right. I'm. I'm. I'm glad that you. Uh... Who's this? Uh, this is Brooke? Brooke. Yes. Um. I mean, we got a Day of the Dead vibe going on. That's that's kind of cool. Yes. Uh, Unless he's really dead. A, uh, he is actually dead, and basically he eats a devil fruit. Wait, that wait, gives wait. Is he playing a? Is he playing a? Um, a violin. A violin. He is a musician, and that also means he does play guitar. Um, I can find it. Yeah, here, here, here's a good picture of him. Yeah, playing but I mean, guitar. the violin means he could be playing "The Devil Went Down to Georgia," which is really cool for a dead guy to be doing. <laughs> all right, so, top tier. Okay, okay, all right, all right, okay. <laughs> I'm loving this. Okay, this is Karu. It's a duck that's got the the St. Bernard Rescue Dog, you know, barrel thing going on. Uh, it, it, like, is that like so we can take some sips of of, of juicy juice or something? Or, <laughs> but um, I don't I don't know. Um, uh, what are you feeling? What the heck is no, that? No, I was just, I was just like seems boring. Like okay, what, okay, all right, all right. You know, okay. Uh, what's this one? This is Capone Beggy. So oh, th- th- this this is so this the, is like like Al Capone, but yeah, yeah, but yeah, anime? yeah. Inspiration, but and he he he's like he's like so, the whole like New York accent, like oh, Chicago guy, wheels look, guns, has like the name. Like he, he's got he's got the name. Yeah, he's got the cigar. He's top tier. You know, I know the other thing is, like, he often uh, has, like, more than one cigarette in his mouth. Oh, thanks to top tier. <laughs> oh, move him, move him all the way up here. <laughs> um, okay. All right. Okay. Cool. 
Wow. So we got like the elegance with so, right so, here. Yeah. 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 So this is this and is this is the kind of guy who's like. Oh, that's my, a guy. Yes, this is a guy. Oh, uh, I didn't. At first, uh, like I thought, like I, 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 I know, I know the hair can be a little bit confusing. This is a, this is the no, kind of guy. No, 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 no insult to. Cavendish, sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah. So uh, this, this is the kind of guy that's like my looks are everything. He's like night egotistical knight in shining armor type. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, because it could it could have been like rocking the whole, you know. Hello, my name is Indigo Montoya. Uh, unfortunately, that is not the type of character he is at all. That's like the exact opposite of his character type. Uh. I mean, but see, I, I, you know, I'm looking at, like, you know, presentation here, mm-hmm. and uh, I, I got to put that in tier two. Uh, the seems, seems really, really cool. cool. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Let's see. The next one. What is Caesar Clown? Yes. Uh, okay. Okay. I mean, I got he, a Joker he, vibe going on here. He has a fruit that lets him control gas. So, like, all different kinds of gases is what he can manipulate. I mean, does that mean he can, like, empty a room real fast? Or? <laughs> I don't I don't <laughs> believe so. Uh, I don't think anything like that is ever confirmed in One Piece, but I'm sure it's possible. <laughs> Oh man! All right. Um, I, you know what? Uh, the, the the Joker call outs are kind of cool. We'll go with the mid tier on that one. Looks cool. All yeah. right. Okay. Oh, there's more than one clown hanging around here. Chopper clown. Whoa. Oh. Oh oh oh! Oops. I, I okay okay. I, I I forgot. Okay, his name is just. Chopper, not oh, Chopper okay. Clown. That that's my bad. Uh, <laughs> I forgot to remove that's that from funny. his name. Uh, um, Chopper. Okay, he is uh, he's a doctor. So he's like the doctor character for the main pirate crew that the story follows. That's kind of boring. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, <laughs> not even the fact that he's a reindeer. <laughs> well, does that mean he ran over grandma? No, no, no. no. Uh, this this uh, this next one is another uh, uh, another one that's really up there for me as a character I really like. Crocodile. Yes. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. So we're 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 Captain Hook. Yeah. With yeah. a cigar. Yes, and and, and he, a cool and, version of the the cloak. I mean, it's fur. Yeah, yeah we got the yeah, fur going on yeah. there. He has a devil fruit that lets him control sand. So he's Mister Sandman. Bring me a dream. Basically, yeah. But more, but probably more likely, given him, you know, uh, he's more like Enter Sandman. Yeah, actually, yeah, yeah, def- definitely like, more that. And, yeah, you know. Like this is another really good picture out here. We, we can't we can't hum the song because th- that copyright violation. But <laughs> but we will we will. Um, what were you thinking on 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 well, crocodile? I mean, uh, you know, crocodile. If I didn't if I didn't you know put him in top tier, uh, James Hetfield would have issues. So because <laughs> he's okay. like Mr. Sandman and you know because he's you know, Enter Sandman. Okay, this is Crocus. I think they were a heavy metal band. Uh, this guy is another doctor. Uh, he looks like the kind of doctor that you actually don't want to have to go to because, like, <laughs> you don't end up like healthy afterwards. <laughs> um, like he's like the evil doctor. Uh huh. Yeah. Um, okay. So, yeah, let's go with the uh, looks cool. Okay. All right. Who's this? The Don. The Don. Yes. Uh, I'm not really sure what's going on here. <laughs> you feeling this? Yeah. <laughs> okay. That was quick. I uh, yeah. All right. 
I'm, I'm very curious to see what you think about this next one. Uh, who's this? This is Don Quixote do Flamingo. That's his, like, full name. So he's you have named to, you, after... You, you, you have to say the full name because it sounds way cooler. So he's, he's, he's named after a guy who tilts at windmills. And his devil fruit allows him to control strings. Which actually has a lot more versatility than you would think. Uh, okay. Um, He's my favorite villain in One Piece. I, so I'm. So here, he, here we go. We got we got uh, a, a weird call out to a very confused guy who who used to try to joust windmills. Okay. He's got a pink feather thing going on with. It's supposed to be his his he, coat. What, what, he's that, wearing flats. That, that's his. That's his I mean, coat. To the the the. Okay. He's got the cool sunglasses. Kinda. All right. I, what, I, what, no, are you, what are you I, thinking I, on him? Which one of these? Uh, I, I'm gonna go with boring on that one. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Sorry, I just okay, I okay. Don Don Krieg. So oh, basically, I put Don King in there, and I was like, no, "What no, the no, boxing no. promoter, dude?" No, no, no. So basically, the idea behind this guy, he doesn't have a devil fruit power necessarily, but his whole thing is like, he has a ton of weapons and, and stuff on him. Ah, uh, that's clear, and he's got like golden plate mail armor. Uh-huh. I yeah. mean, <laughs> you know, it would probably work out better for him if he like, <laughs> all the way down, you know, not just like. You know, torso. <laughs> yeah, because like, like, yeah. If I'm if I'm fighting the guy, I'm like, take out his legs. Look, he's just wearing jeans. <laughs> right. Like, right. come on. You know, uh, or, or you know, I don't know, but I mean, the the rest of it's looking pretty cool. Um, so what are you thinking on this guy? I, I'll uh, I'll put him in the the second one there. Yeah. Okay. If he had full plate mail, we would have we, we could we really would have rocked in it then. This is core zone. What's with the black furry thing? He's uh Do Flamingo's brother. Okay. Uh meh. D- d- don't really care? Okay. That's, that's... Goes alongside his brother. Yeah. All right, I think I think you're gonna like the next one. This is Dragon. Oh, so we're looking like you know that, that's kind of like to me like the classic, you know, hairstyle going on there. And and he, uh, he is he's the leader of the revolutionary I, army. He kind of actually has got the the clothing style of, like, you know, Count Dracula or something, except it's green and blue. So, what I'll tell you about him is he's the leader of the revolutionaries. Well, no, but he's got he's got the whole get-up, and he's got the the hair. See, so, so you like him? Yeah, like we're, him? we're good with that guy. Uh, uh, which one? Um, second tier, yeah. Okay, all right, all right. Uh, okay, okay. Uh. Okay, this is Diaz Drake. Okay, it's... Sometimes he has a mohawk because everyone wears a hat. Is that like a eye patch? Of some kind? Uh, yes. Kind of. But not really because so it still shows my his My problem arm. is like, all right, dude, you, you don't need to put a big X on, on your, on your, in the middle of your torso as like, please hit me here. <laughs> well, so, so his other name is X Drake. Which is okay, a, but you still don't need to like, like, <laughs> like put a big like, you know. I don't know. No. Yeah, I don't get. 
Why you don't like X marks the spot? It's like please, right here, get me. No, come on, man. Okay, all right. Um, okay. I think you're gonna like this next guy. Who's this? Oh, hold on, hold on. Uh, okay. This is Eniru, and basically the idea behind him is he calls himself a god and he has lightning power. I mean, he's rocking a bow staff. Yeah, definitely. Right there. Totally. Uh -huh. um, the pants are a little weird. Okay. <laughs> um, but I guess if he ever fell into water, he'd have built-in flotation device. Uh-huh. So I don't know what's going on with the stuff around his head. I think it looks cool, personally. Um, but... Wait, what are you thinking on this one? Looks yeah, cool? mid mid middle. Yeah, okay. We're, we're okay with that. All right. Okay. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> another dude with an X like marking like hit me here. Uh. <laughs> This is Demaro Black. <laughs> uh, meh. Meh, okay, all right. Okay. Oh, hold on, let me uh, fix that. There we go. Who is this, Foxy? Yeah, this is Foxy. Is he a fox? No. <laughs> <laughs> Because he just looks weird. <laughs> what, what the... He's got, like, Aladdin shoes on. Um, uh, what the heck is that? Okay. <laughs> that, 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 that's, a, that's a good response, I think. Okay. So, you got two things you can look at. This is an earlier design of him. And this is a later design once he, like, redesigns himself. Uh, this is Frankie, and he's a cyborg. Oh, okay, right. So then he put, like, you know, dumbbells on his shoulders or something? I don't know what's going uh, on It there. basically has, like, really big arms. It have, like, a ton of weapons in him, and he's, like, super strong and can also, like, punch stuff. I mean, a little weird, but okay. Let's put him in the middle. Okay. Okay. Now, this is Fujitora. He is another Marine Admiral, and he is blind. But, uh. but he has gravity power. Yeah, but you know, like the 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 the, the, old, the old blind like weapon master or something. Those yeah, are the most yeah, dangerous yeah, or something. Yeah, yeah. It, especially because he's a very skilled swordsman without even using his gravity powers. Oh uh, yeah, and you, you know got the cool coat. Yeah, well, all right, man. Top yeah, tier. Yeah, sure. All right. Okay. Um. Uh, I, I gotta remember what this character's name is. Uh, yeah, I can't help you with that one. Hold on. Okay, I got it now. Uh, give me a second. Okay. This is Fukuboshi, and he is another fish man. I mean... So as I, like, said, so as I said, they tend to vary in design. I mean, it looks like uh, they took Poseidon and, and stuck a mer tail thing on it. Like, I, think, I think his design looks pretty cool, personally. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm just getting, you know, I'm getting the whole Poseidon vibe. We got the trident. We got, mm -hmm. 
you know, re- all right. We'll, 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 we'll give him we'll give him looks cool for the re- release of the Kraken vibes. Okay, uh, I actually don't remember the name of this guy. So we're gonna skip him. Uh, next we have Garp. Now, now you remember the dragon that we that we talked about earlier? Uh-huh. Uh huh. This guy is his dad. I mean, he's obviously ro- he's rocking um, the coat. He's not an admiral; he's a vice admiral. So, well, I mean, I don't really care about rank. Uh-huh. So, because he's got he's got the suit. I mean, you know, we got the nice nice you know blue t- blue thing going on with the tie. Mm-hmm. Just you know, subtle subtle bit of color there, and and uh, also he's seventy eight years old. Oh, he looks really good for his age. Yeah. Uh, well done. And he's in at this age, uh, he's still like one of the strongest characters in the whole series. Yeah, all right. Well, he wins it for me then. Top tier? Yeah, sure. Okay. I don't remember who that is. <laughs> um All right. This is Jin. Jin. <laughs> yeah. Does he have a brother named Rummy? No. Oh. Does that he, be kind of he's, funny? He's like the main servant of Don Krieg. Oh. What what, what is he holding? I like think, a large I, 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 I think <laughs> No, I think it's like a mace of some kind or something. Uh, I, I'm, I'm not... Com- Completely sure. Uh, it's some kind of metal ball on a stick. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, <laughs> well, sorry, that that's that, boring. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, he's a very forgettable uh, side character. Okay, now this is the King of the Pirates, Goldie Roger. One of the most important characters in the entire story, basically. King of Pirates, huh? Yes. Well, I mean, he's got the pirate look. Uh, you know. Yeah, like when you think of this, when you look at this guy, you think traditional pirate, right? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, although I don't know how many pirates, you know, you know, were rocking six packs, but <laughs> um, you know, maybe that, you know, that I mean. It, it, you know, props to him though, because you know, I mean, work those abs. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, you like his? Sure, he, he's got he, top tier yeah, or top tier. I mean, okay, come on, he's, he, okay, he's got the whole pack. Look at the guy. I mean, he's like, <laughs> you know, okay. Okay, this is Boa Hancock. Um, she is known as the Pirate Empress and is called the most beautiful woman in the world. I, I'm, I'm giving her top tier on the name. That just rocks. Come on. Boa Hancock. Come okay. on. All right. Okay. I don't remember this guy's name. That's Pharaoh. <laughs> That's not his name. Oh. Uh, I don't remember what his name is. So, well, then, so I, then I have named we're, him. We're just going to skip it. <laughs> I have bequeathed him the name of Pharaoh. Okay. All right. Um, This is Basil Hawkins. Wow. He he is much more pathetic than his name sounds. I mean, he's got, like, the amazing name and and the face of, like, my life is utter crap. (laughs) You know, like 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 life sucks, and I'm a part of it. Okay. I don't know that that's a tough one because the, the name. Uh-huh. You know, uh-huh. come on. Uh, I, what do you do with that one? I, I, that, I that that's a. Uh, I I I got. I guess he's middle of the road. Yeah, it looks cool. It looks okay. cool. I, I, yeah, that's tough. Okay. Uh, this 
is Helmeppo. Helmeppo. Yes. Helmeppo. Yes. Okay. That's his name. Wait, which one is he? Uh, the guy with the blonde hair. This is a guy that we'll get to a little bit later, I think. Oh, okay. So what's the black? Thing? I think I think it's like a visor of some kind. Because he's not always wearing it, or some images have him without it. This is an older image, and this is him like later on in the series, once he becomes a Marine. Eh. Meh. Boring? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Alright. Next, we have... So basically, if 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 there was a steroid addict as a One Piece character, it would be this guy. I mean, he doesn't look that buff. Well, oh, that one doesn't. Some of those pictures, he does. He he basically injects a ton of steroids to make himself more powerful. So here here here's a good comparison image. Oh, I get it. So it was like normal, and then he like, like powers bu- up. Yeah, powers up by using steroids. Uh, that's kind of cool. Okay. Yeah, well, that looks cool. That's fine. Okay. Uh, this is Iceberg. Well, the pinstripe suit, I mean, that gets you a lot of points. I think I think he has a pretty sleek design personally. I mean, he you know, and he's got the he's got the the the, the dapper Dan hair. This is like a younger version of him. Oh no, he definitely got got way way more uh, way later. better with uh, uh, except uh, when he's picking his that, nose. That's, that's not a flattering him, is he nor that one. Uh, uh well we'll discount the nose picking. I mean, okay. you know. Yeah, you know, Every, uh, everyone has their off days. Uh, we'll put him in tier two. Okay. Seems really cool. All right. Um, okay. This is Inazuma. What is she? Oh, she's got the whole the whole the. Uh, it's 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 one hundred one Dalmatian. It's, it's, it's not bad a she. lady. What, what's her name? And it, it's not movie? a she. Oh, I think it it's, still looks I like think it. It's supposed to be a transgender character, but I'm honestly not sure. Well, but it's still the 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 he, the, he, he, the he, looks, he looks is, like is, Corella Deville. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, <laughs> I couldn't. Uh, <laughs> Getting I Cruella mean, vibes from got, this. Exactly. I mean, rock the Cruella vibes. I mean, <laughs> okay, you know. <laughs> She she, right. she knew what she wanted, right? I mean, it was uh, it was twisted yeah, and messed I, I mean, up, but I mean, f- fair enough. So I where mean, are you putting him? F- yeah, that's good. Right there, okay. All right. Wow. Okay. This what, is this is what he won cub. What the heck is that? <laughs> Uh, meant this is this this is supposed to be like a play on like a drag queen type deal. Oh, oh, oh. I mean, okay, but <laughs> I, I'm, I'm sorry. What the heck is that? Okay, <laughs> all right. Um, all right. This is Izo. Is that a... It is a guy. It's a guy. But he's got the whole traditional garb on, it looks like. Uh, uh, that's... Uh, the, well, I mean, that type of clothing is centered around a major arc. It's like the setting of, of a location of an arc is, like, based on Japan. It's like well, that's what I was... Yeah, I was getting the so, whole... So, yeah. Um, basically, like, uh, uh, he, he's, he's a transgender character. But it's, um, it, he's got the whole feudal Japanese... The feudal Japanese look. Yeah, yeah. A couple other characters and, uh, do as you know, well because they're they're samurai. Um, uh, but instead of using a sword, he actually like double wields pistols. 
which I think is kind of unique for a samurai type character. Well, yeah, because a samurai would use a katana. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah. Right. Is that yeah. The, probably. Yeah. yeah. Katana. Yeah. Um, I, I'll, I'll give him tier two. Okay. All right. Um, I don't remember what that guy's name is. Who's this? This is Bonnie. Does she lie over the ocean? I don't know. Um, but she is 12 years old. I I find that hard to believe. I'm dead serious. Um, the reason she looks like this is because her devil for power is she can control her. She can, like, look different ages. Well, well, okay, so, but that explains that. Okay. Yeah. I gotcha, because that's clearly not a 12-year-old there. Uh-huh. Um, I mean, you know, got the pink hair, got the green hat. I mean, sure, let's go with tier two. All right. This next one's a character I really like. Uh, this is another fish man. Jimbe. Is he poisonous? Uh, no. In fact, uh, his main thing is he is he does uh, this thing called Fishman Karate, which is like a fighting style where that like emphasizes his, the use of like water and stuff like that. Okay. But he's got poison symbols all over his. Oh, oh, oh! That that's just his garment. This is a different like picture. Oh, okay. It's just like different pattern robes and such. I mean, he kind of looks like an ogre to me. <laughs> you know. Fair enough. But we'll go. We'll go middle of the road. Okay, I'll take that. Uh, I don't remember the name of that guy either. Uh. This is Kaku. Is he Pinocchio? <laughs> no. Because um, he borrowed <laughs> Pinocchio's nose. <laughs> um, and this is his devil for power. He transforms into a giraffe. I'm sorry, but the dude got ripped off when he went through the devil fruit. <laughs> Power like <laughs> store. I, I think like the, the he same got in there thing. and I think the same. He got like thing. the rotten one, or <laughs> I mean, like man, I, I, I. There's a couple different uh, uh, outfit options to look at here. I, I can't be too harsh on him because I just like feel bad for him. <laughs> it's like. Like out of pity, I gotta put him. I gotta put him into the into the seems boring, even though it's kind of a what the heck is going on. Okay, stealing Pinocchio's nose, but you know. All right, this is Katakuri. Well, I mean, he's got a lot of sharp teeth. Oh, that's a pretty wicked looking weapon there. This is his face, like, not covered by the scarf. That's what I'm saying. Look at them. Like, like, uh, oh, yeah, he's got some, that's supposed to be, like, scars with stitches and, you know, yeah, all yeah. right, all right. You'd never guess his favorite food is donuts. Well, you know, a lot of people like donuts. I mean, <laughs> I can't, you know, I won't criticize <laughs> I mean, you know, uh, you like, like you like this a little guy? bit weird with the boots and the spurs because, like, does he ride a horse at all? I uh, no. Yeah, so why do you have spurs on your boots? Mm. But I'm still gonna go with looks cool. Okay. I don't remember who that character is. <laughs> um. I think you might like this next guy just based on the name. This is Killer. Well, it looks like he's like 
he stole the hockey mask from from Jason and Friday the 13th and painted it blue and stuff. <laughs> um, he's got an interesting weapon there. Yeah, he 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 wields like uh, spinning knives or blades or whatever. Okay. Like mechanisms on his arms, I think. I mean. Sure, that's middle tier. Okay. Oh, wait. Okay. All right. Uh, this next one is a proper uh, samurai. Um, this is Kinemon. So you can see here he's got like the actual swords and such. Yeah. I mean, the robe is a little bit like, like pick one, right? You know, <laughs> go stripes or go, go, you know, monocolored. But it's like you couldn't couldn't decide, and it, it, neither work. Um, yeah, that's that's uh, meh. Okay. This is Koala. All right. Another uh, leading member of the Revolutionary Army. Wow. Uh, doesn't look like a big fighter, though. Is they like... Are those, like, pilot goggles on, on there? I think. I'm not, I'm not completely sure. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm, this is not inspiring in any way, shape, or form. <laughs> Boring. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um... Okay, so this is the character that was alongside Helmepa earlier. Uh, now, this is him at the very beginning of the series, but then he grows up a little bit, and, and by much later in the series, he's looking like this. I mean, the problem is, is like, on him, the whole the whole, the whole jacket thing just kind of looks... It doesn't look as Awkward. good? Okay. All right. Interesting. So, so where are we going to put him? Meh. Meh? All right. I don't remember the character. That name is the uh, character's name. Uh, let's see. Is it like a wooden practice sword? Uh, yeah, yeah, basically she's like a, she, she's like, uh... Really young? Uh, yeah. Uh, she dies at a young age. Oh, that's sad. But she's like a top swordsman, but she dies from a mysterious accident that's never explained. Ah. Uh, I mean, she seems cool. I mean, yeah, okay. Right. Feel bad for her. <laughs> Uh, I'm curious what you'll think about the next one. This is Bartholomew Kuma. Now, where I am at ca fully caught up in the story, he's like one of the most geniusly written characters. But obviously we know anything about that, so I just I mean, wanted to mention that as commentary, but... He's rocking the name Bart. <laughs> okay. Indeed. Although I mean, he's called Kuma most of the time. Uh, he's very large. Yeah, we got some, you know, disproportionality going on, which is... Uh, he's also a cyborg. Uh, okay. Should be noted. Uh, I'm middle of the road on... Like, on looks, looks cool? Yeah. That's fine. Okay. Uh, this is Dr. Kareha. Alright. She's 141 years old. That's 
old. Mm-hmm. Kind of looks like a, a certain rock stars from the late 60s. <laughs> I mean... You know what? I never noticed that. It kind of matches, like, the hair and stuff. Yeah. Uh, she's also a doctor. Uh, get out. It's in her name. <laughs> Uh, I didn't realize I, I said Dr. Korea. Um, she looks cool. Yeah, I mean, you know, she could have been rocking Woodstock. Okay, and then next we have, this is Crow. No, that's Edward Scissorhands. <laughs> <laughs> well, not exactly, because he doesn't have scissors on his hands. Well, neither did did Edward Scissorhands. Did he not? No. It looked just like that. Oh, yeah, that's right. So somebody ripped that. off from somebody else. I'm not sure <laughs> which came first, but... I mean, because Edward Scissorhands was like a movie in the like, 90s. Yeah, it was a very, very weird movie. Um... Uh, meh. Okay. Okay. Um. This is he, guy is, is he missing a leg. Uh, yes. Wow. How does that work? Um. He fights on one leg. <laughs> That's some pretty impressive balance, I and, guess. And and he's and he's like supposed to represent like a Roman gladiator type. So did he like hop around? Uh, no, no. He uh, his prime fighting days were like before he lost his leg. Oh, because I mean they like make him look like he's gonna go fight somebody there. But he still he still does a, a magnificent job fighting with only one one leg he's like a he's like a certified badass even when fighting only on one leg i mean i gotta give a props for for a guy fighting on one leg so yeah tier two for that one okay 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 this is a laboon this it's is like, the, this is the kid laboon and this is the adult laboon. It's like a, a cute killer whale. It's like an emoji. <laughs> you know, I never noticed that. It's, it's, it does look like an emoji. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what do you think going on him? Uh, he looks kind of cute. Yeah, sure. I mean, you know, he's an emoji. <laughs> uh, okay. This this next one's another character I really like. This character's name is Trafalgar Law. As in named after the Battle of? I believe so, yeah. All right. Uh he also carries a uh cool sword and he has one of the most broken devil fruits in the entire series. So he got first in line when he went to go to the Devil Fruit store, and, and Pinocchio dude was like, <laughs> Pinocchio dude was at the end. And so this dude got like busted, He's basically. Like, yeah. And, and then Pinocchio dude comes, up, oh man, giraffe. <laughs> oh, kind of yeah. All right, all right. Well, I mean, top tier for that. Okay, okay. I don't remember who that is. Okay. Let's see here. This is Rob Lucci. And his devil fruit power is he basically turns into a leopard. I'm not sure. I mean, but, I mean, he's got, like, the, the whole, like, hat and coat and I mean he's rocking it mm -hmm. I mean 
Yeah, uh, he's top tier. Top tier. Okay. All right. Okay. This next character is the main character of the whole series. This is Monkey D. Luffy. This is like an earlier version of him. I mean... I like the hat. Yeah, you know? that that's like that's like the most iconic part of his design, so I mean he's the, got the, the hat, right? Yeah, yeah. The entire name of the main group that you follow is the Straw Hat Pirates, so Well, alright, top tier on that regard then. <laughs> nice. <laughs> um Oh, what's the name of this guy? I don't know, we're going to skip it. Okay. This is Magellan. I don't think Magellan really looked like that. I mean... <laughs> no, he was, no, he was, he was no. busy sailing around the world, no. right? Yeah. I mean... Um, or is this is this what happened? Like he he ended up like this after he got lost in the the Philippines or wherever. <laughs> uh, maybe um, <laughs> he his devil fruit is he controls poison. I mean, he looks like a devil. Now, do you want me to tell you something that might bring down your opinion of him or not? I mean, I'm just trying to like get the vibe of the guy. He's got like a metal glove on or something. Because what I what I what I would tell you completely changes the vibe of him. So uh, do you want to hear that or or just be, rank it? Based no, on I, I think I think we're 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 we're, we're you know we're gonna okay put him to okay two. okay all right okay okay. How many sail around the world? Come on. This is Eustace Kid. His whole power is he controls magnets. So he's Magneto. Basically, yeah, but like but and he, but he ha only has like a metal arm, but he has a metal arm. I don't think Magneto has a metal arm and stuff. Uh, no. Um I mean, it looks cool to me. Oh, that, that is definitely cool looking. Uh, sure, it looks cool. Looks cool. Okay, next we have... This is Makino. Seems nice. Yeah? Looks cool. Sure. I don't remember the name of that character or that one. Ooh. Okay. I'm, I'm very curious to see what you think about this next. This is Dracul Mihawk, the world's strongest swordsman. That sword is, uh... Very massive. <laughs> Not usable in any way, shape, or form. The cross guard on it is insane. He makes it work. <laughs> Don't you think he looks cool, though? I mean... Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'll put him in the middle tier. Wow, okay. Okay, next we have... This is Monet. I mean... Not, no affiliation to the artist. Monet or Monet? 
It's it's Monet. <laughs> In in the series, it's Monet. In One Piece, it's Monet. Uh, yeah. Um, I mean, is she a harpy? Is that the deal? I don't know, because her devil fruit power, she controls snow. Okay. So, I don't know. <laughs> I, I, I don't snow. I, I'm not getting a good impression here. <laughs> okay. Uh, what the heck is that? No, it's just boring. Okay. Oh, boy. Am I excited to see what you think about this next one. Oops. Uh. <laughs> I mean, I got <laughs> this is a pretty easy I got, I got one five words for you. Five words. What the heck <laughs> is that? <laughs> Next. <laughs> okay. All right. Oh, that, that was amazing. Oh, okay. Uh, this is Nami, um, another one of the major characters on the Straw Hats. Um, in the beginning of the series, she kind of has, like, shorter hair in near, uh, in the later, um, arc, she kind of grows out her hair. Wow, got grown out hair and a quarterstaff. Uh, yeah, she's the navigator. All right. For the crew. Um... I mean, nothing like like super wow, but very very cool nonetheless. So we're gonna go tier two on that one. Okay. Okay. Next one. This is another. Uh, this is basically like Fukuboshi we saw earlier. This is his dad. We already basically. had Neptune, dude. Uh, this is his. This is the. Oh, this so Neptune dad. dude and Neptune dad. Yeah, basically, this uh, is this is this is Neptune dad. I mean, I for obvious reasons, I rank any dad character very very highly. <laughs> uh, put him in the top. All right, all right, okay. Especially if he tells any jokes. Does he tell jokes? I don't think so. Oh, man. Neptune dad jokes would be amazing. Okay, this is Robin. All right. Uh, one of my absolute favorite characters in the series. Very elegant. Got the the the, the flower petals going on there. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Her her flower flower fruit basically means that she can like flower a ton of hands and like create like extra limbs and things like that. Um, That's a little weird, but I don't know the the, the thing going on. I mean. I, just, just by you know looks, I'll, I'll, I'll give her uh, um, tier two there. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let's see here. Um, next one was okay. Uh, okay. This is Nojiko. Uh, this is Nami's sister. All right. So this is like the other daughter of Bellamere that we saw earlier. Oh, okay, gotcha. I mean, yeah, tier two. Okay. Yeah, I'll I'll put them together. Actually, you, you know, there we go. Like like uh, they're a family, right? Yeah. Uh, oh, fucking. Uh, good. There, there we go. There we go. Okay. Um. Yeah. Yeah. This is Hachan. It's, it's, so, an, it's another kind of fish man. 
Uh, we're doing the whole Shiva thing, huh? <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, I don't think that's really what it's meant to represent. I think it's supposed to be kind of like an octopus ish. Oh. But it's got six. Well, I'll get eight when you count the legs. Okay, I get you. Um, I, I'm, I'm meh. Sorry. Meh, all right. This is Robin's mom. I mean, this is, you know, classic. Dies when she's a little kid. Oh, very, very, very tragically, yes. Uh, but very, you know, pretty classic look here. I mean, um, I'll, I'll go with tier two. Okay. Uh, put her... It doesn't matter. Just stick her in tier two. Okay, there we go. <laughs> uh, what's the next one? I don't remember that guy's name. Uh, okay. This is Polly. I mean, side note that apparently there's a women's bathing suit <laughs> that is named Polly. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's that was not intentional. Let me tell you, I, I d don't worry. But, this is not well, something I look up in my free time or anything like that. <laughs> no, no, I think it's just hilarious because you're typing yeah. Polly One Piece, and of course, it doesn't know the difference. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, as far as the oh, oh, I, I guess this is how you spell his name. This is probably better. <laughs> Get some uh, more pictures of him. He's a shipbuilder. I mean, he's rocking the cigar. Uh, you know, and that's... that's kind, the, kind, kind of to me looks like the kind, kind of, of guy kind that... kind of got the Oakley sunglasses thing going on. Well, All right, he, too. Yeah, yeah, it looks like a kind of guy that, like, does, holds up a solid job every day, you know? You know, uh, he's got the whole, I'm, 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 I'm getting it done vibe going on. Okay. This is Pell. This is what his devil fruit looks like. He turns into a uh, falcon. I mean, that's pretty cool looking. Yeah. All right, tier two. Okay. <laughs> uh, I'm curious what you'll think about this next one. So, we can look at this one. There's also this image as well. Uh, a kind of a Harlequin thing going on, maybe? Kind of, but her personality also isn't like that at all. <laughs> it's like Harlequin meets Mary Poppin meets weird other stuff. I don't know. Um, uh... Uh, uh, I guess middle tier. I, 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 that one's a hard one. I don't. Looks cool. Yeah, sure. Okay. Next one is like one of my favorite characters. This this guy is so cool. I mean, and yes, he does have a pineapple head. Um, but. Like his head is a literal pineapple. No, no, but it's it's a it's a joke that looks like one. Oh, oh, I see what you're saying. Okay, his head is not physically a pineapple, but his devil fruit is one of the coolest. It basically like transforms him into a phoenix, and he can like heal himself and heal others while also using the flames to damage his enemies. All right. I mean, that seems tier two worthy to me. Tier two? Okay. Mm. 
Okay, so this is Kiku. Uh, this is Izo's brother, or sister, I mean. But the idea is, like, while Izo kind of acts more, like, dresses like female, uh, Kiko is, like, a girl, but is way more tomboyish in her interests and such. I don't know. I mean, that's a very traditional Japanese get-up there. Yes, because she is a samurai. Um... I mean, yeah, we'll we'll give her a uh, uh, looks cool. Oh, uh, uh, ooh. oh, this next one's one of my absolute favorite characters. This is Sabo. Wow, we're 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 rocking the uh, what was that uh, late eighteen hundreds London vibe. Oh yes, and, and he has fire powers. Um, basically, like, when, when a person dies, their devil fruit, like, reappears somewhere else in the world. So basically what happened is, when Ace died, Sabo ate the devil fruit that gave Ace the flame powers as a way of, like, continuing on the legacy, because they're actually brothers. Uh-huh. Not, like, blood-related, but, like, in terms of, like, you know... Brotherhood, like brothers in arms type. Things. I mean, he looks he looks pretty he looks pretty down with it. So uh, yeah, I will give them top tier, top tier. Nice. Okay. Uh, I don't remember the name of yeah, her. Okay. One of the most popular characters in the series. This is Sanji. Uh, he has a ton of different looks with, like, different suits that he changes. So you can get, like, a lot of different pictures. Oh, man, I'm totally getting Clockwork Orange vibes here. Um, he is the cook of the Straw Hat Pirates. Okay, that wouldn't fit Clockwork Orange, but... Um, I seems cool to me. Sure. Go ahead. Okay, I'm curious what you think about this next one. This is Scratchman Apu. What, so he's like Mr. Fantastic or something? <laughs> no. <laughs> Actually, he has like music-related powers, I think. What's with the long arms? I don't know. <laughs> he's the law. The long arm of the law. <laughs> the, the ironic thing about that is he's like one of the most scummiest backstabbing characters in, in all of One Piece. <laughs> That's the really funny thing about that description. <laughs> oh man, yeah, I'm gonna put him in, uh, you know, uh, the middle tier there. Okay. All right. Okay, this is Sengoku. I mean, he looks like a pretty, you know... He he is the fleet admiral, which is I like mean... one rank above the admirals in the marines. Uh, his devil fruit is basically like he transforms into this giant Buddha oh. thing. Like golden Buddha type statue. Golden Buddha? Yeah. Oh, oh man, that's yeah. that's top tier then. Top tier or uh, yeah, good 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 choice. Okay, let's see. Let's find, uh... This is Senior maybe <laughs> your pink, <laughs> senior pink, S senior. Oh, senor, senor. Oh, as in, okay, like... Senor Pink. Does he speak Spanish? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> What's, what does that say? Something baby? Eats baby? Uh, no, I, I can't... I can't tell. I'm, I'm trying to... Let's Baby? I, I, I think it's Let's Baby. 
You what the heck is that? <laughs> okay. <laughs> if I cared, you would probably go there. He's a, a, a bit of a strangely designed character. Uh... This is Sentamaru. Oh. He really got the axe, didn't he? <laughs> yeah, indeed. Um, clearly does not ask questions. <laughs> Good one. Um, um, at, think... at a certain point later on, he does gain the coat. So yeah, but it doesn't really fit him. He doesn't really fit. So him. Uh, we'll put him in the middle of the road there. Okay. Let's see. Oh yeah, I meant Shanks. One of the most powerful characters in the series. Well, that first picture gave me like like Bradley Cooper vibes there. Uh, this is very early picture, <laughs> yeah. and, and 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 this is this is like oh, more okay. modern animation of him, but this is like like beginning of this or, or like you um, know got like, the, like earlier animation. Got the the. Uh... I I always thought Shanks had like a very like clean you know inoffensive design yeah. that, that looked pretty solid. I mean, he's, but he's got the Dracula cape going on. Uh huh. So we'll give him points for that. We'll put him t tier two there. Okay. This is another one of my favorite characters. Uh, this is a guy that is seventy-eight years old. He was the second. He was like the right-hand man to the king of the pirates, basically. Mm. And um, he's still extremely powerful, but he just spends his days chilling and like uh, repairing boats, basically repairing ships. Uh, this is a younger image of him, basically. This is what his face looked like when he was younger in his prime. Mm. Yeah, I mean, tier two for me. Okay. Smoker. I mean, you know, his, his devil fruit power is he literally controls smoke. I mean, he's like you know, kind of doing the whole Schwarzenegger and Predator thing going on. So he also has the cape. I mean, yeah, it's here too. Okay. Okay. Okay, this is Sugar. She's sweet. Mm hmm. But she's not a kid, though. She's Sugar. She's. Sweet. Yeah, yeah, I know. Okay. <laughs> she, yeah. Hmm? I, I mean, I don't know. You know. Looks cool to me. Okay. All right. Let's see. This is Tashiki. Um, sure, looks cool to me. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Tom is another fish man. Uh, he's also a shipwright. He's uh, basically the one that was like the teacher of iceberg. He's a big round thing. <laughs> yeah, with legs. Uh huh. And arms. Mm -hmm. He's like. I I'm sorry. That's a boring. <laughs> okay. Thing. Yeah. All right. I don't know what to do with that. Uh. I generally cannot tell what that's supposed to be. 
Ooh, okay. I think this one should be interesting. What do you think of this fellow here? This is Baruch. I mean, he looks a little odd for an angel. <laughs> is he supposed to be an angel? Some kind of, like, angel monk thing, I think. I mean, that's a cool concept. Cool design, I think. Yeah, it looks B cool. A bit strange, but... Looks cool, all right. This is another one of the main characters, Usopp. Uh, this is what he looks like at the beginning of the series, and then what he looks like now. Oh, another guy who stole Pinocchio's nose. But I, I think this guy has a better case of it than Kaku does, honestly. I don't know. He he doesn't have a, a giraffe devil fruit, so... Well, only one guy could get really, you know, screwed on the devil. <laughs> I don't know. There were there were there's a there's a there's a few people. I, I like um th there's one character in particular that has a devil I don't know if it's on this uh tier list maker, but there's one character in particular I can I can think of that like got majorly screwed on the devil fruit department. Um uh, well this guy is He's another one of the main characters. He's a sniper. Well, I, I, I'm not uh, meh. Like, okay. Whatever. Okay. Um, let's see. The interesting thing about this guy is he like pretend to be a marine. Wait, does he does he like coffee? Or is that tea? I think it might be T. Um, the interesting thing about this guy is, like, he's a, um... I mean, points to the glasses. He's, 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 like, he used to be a Marine, but he betrayed the Marines. I mean, I don't know, the whole glasses, sipping the tea or coffee, that, that, that works for me, tier two. Go ahead. This is Reiju. Yeah, nice. This is Sanji's sister. Got a, a nice cape and everything. Tier two. Okay. Or three, or I don't know. Uh, this is Viola. Oh, that's like... Um... A dress they would wear in Spain. Yeah, it's Flamenco. it's it's supposed to represent like that kind of because the arc that the location that this arc is from is like heavily like in terms of like architecture and designs very much based on like Italy, or something. Italy and Spain yeah. inspirations. So I mean, I'm down with that. that that's that's tier two. This is Vista. Alright, the mustache gives him tier one. Really? That's it. He also has, like, roses and, and stuff with his design. But no, stuff. I mean, I'm sorry, that it, mustache it Immediately, is it. wow, we haven't had a tier one there in a while, okay. Uh, this next one's another, like, personal favorite of mine. This is Vivi. Find a good picture here. She is a princess. She looks like a princess. All right. Well, that's tier two material then. Okay. I think I remember this guy's name. It's... Yeah. Okay.
This is wiper. As in, like, windshield? <laughs> no. <laughs> I mean, is that like a massive rocket launcher? What the heck is that? Yes, that's exactly what that is. I mean, if you're bad enough to be carrying around a rocket launcher, you're tier two in my book. <laughs> okay. I'm, good I, I, stuff, good stuff. I mean, you know, I wouldn't call him windshield wiper then, because, you know, I'd blow you up with this rocket launcher. Maybe it's like Wiper as in like he wipes the floor with you by blasting you with that. <laughs> uh, he wouldn't be much left of you, that's for sure. Uh, this is Yasop. This is Usopp's dad. Oh, another dad? But he's a deadbeat one because he abandoned oh. Usopp as a little kid. Deadbeat dad? Uh-huh. Does he tell jokes? Uh, no. Oh, I'm sorry then. He's, he's meh. Yeah, I know. Oh, that guy's name. Uh, this this next guy is not a dad, but he basically was a father figure for Sanji. Honorary dad, okay. Yeah. I mean, he's dad. He, uh, he's a former pirate turned chef, uh, basically. We, we, the, we got we got mustache tier one qualification. Here. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Um, okay. We just save the best for last. We have my favorite character in the whole of One Piece. It's the one I have the poster of and the one I have the figure for. Uh, this is Zoro. And th there are there are so many awesome pictures that we could look at, the, at for this. You know, you have the but, classic one. This is the one where he's but got he doesn't the three have a mask. swords. He doesn't need one. <laughs> but it's the mask of Zoro. He doesn't need one though. I don't know. I'm gonna give him uh, tier one status because he has a sword in his mouth. Yeah, okay, thank you. <laughs> I mean, anybody can do that. That's, you know... That's... Okay, all right. Um, yeah, the rest of these characters, um, I didn't remember the names of, and I'm not going to spend, like, an extra ten minutes trying to look up what their names well, are based I, on details. I want to put Pharaoh in, in Tier 1 just because I, I said so. <laughs> okay. You know what? Fine. <laughs> put this, this guy <laughs> in Tier 1. Um... So, yeah, so, so, yeah. So, just taking a look through this list, um... It's actually pretty balanced, right? Uh, I mean... <laughs> I, it has a lot of my favorite characters in the top tier, which I'm very happy about. But this is also, like, the weirdest <laughs> character list that anyone is probably ever going to see. Which is what is the entire point of this video. Oh, absolutely. Uh-huh. Um, wow. We, uh, an hour and a half for this video. Well, there were a lot of one of these characters. What, what, uh, what are you gonna uh, do? Again, this was like a small sliver. Um, um, yeah. Uh, yeah, that does it for the entire list. This is the most accurate One Piece character tier list that you will ever see, right? <laughs> oh, I'm sure. <laughs> no other corrections are necessary to this. Um,. Uh, yeah, I had, I had uh, a lot. <laughs> oh, hopefully you all have fun watching it because uh, it was it was it, it was it was a lot of fun to record. Yeah, um, yeah thank you very much for watching, and uh, we'll see you all later. Bye. Bye.